It's right here. Love this record. I smell brothers nylon. I didn't see you there. Hi. Oh, hi. Didn't see you there. Uh, I was just listening to the uh, wonderful sound of, of Caveman Junction. Fantastical! Yeah, I remember the first time I was uh, I couldn't move through the fru. First time you sent me the uh, uh, drum why, track. Yeah, why are you yeah. pulling that voice? This is uh, this is my normal voice. This is my uh, my my voice, mate. That's this not your the, voice. Uh... Do your actual voice. Okay. Well, that is my actual. That voice. one. Yeah. That. Yeah. Keep uh, you... Okay. Fine. So yeah, I remember thinking the first time uh, he sent me those drum tracks, I was just like, I can't move through the fruit. John sent me those tracks, I was just like, no. There's no way that he. Sent... There's no way that he sent me these drum tracks and these vocal tracks and and. Uh. Hey sh hey Sean hey sh hey Sean, why don't you tell us a little something about the Brothers Nine Line? Go for it. And then they'll cut to him. <laughs> the Rufalos is pros. They mofos. Uh, this is my new no-string guitar, which I've never used on a recording before. And um, it, uh, it features probably on this album. And I'd like to thank both Nick and Mike for allowing me the creative freedom and artistic expression um, that was needed in order to break new frontiers with this instrument, so... And I was sort of mesmerized and also I was very uh, honored and thrilled and embraced to know that I would be making f music and we would be making collaborative uh. tunes together. And it's just a very fun-filled project and just filled with a bunch of jams and a bunch of... <laughs> and even a... So, the vinyl is currently being mastered. And by the, uh, we don't know who yet, but it should be someone. It should be someone. <laughs> People ask me how I write. Okay. It's about spontaneity. Makes worth freedom and liberation of one soul. Good. That's how I write my spiels. Okay. My music. Sounds interesting. But that isn't all I'm limited to do. Once you achieve Nirvana, there's no limit to what you can do. Sure. That's what I would say. Good. Thank you very much, guys, and uh, enjoy the record. Oh, really? I can't hear you, mate. Oh, I just, it was so cool. So cool when Sean said, I remember the first time he ever brought up the idea, he sent it through Facebook. He was just like, Uh, yeah, I really want to make a new band. Maybe we should call ourselves the Brothers Nylon, and we should just do like soundtrack, dope, film, noir kind of style music. And I gotta tell you, it was the best thing I've ever heard in my life. 